Hello, everybody, and welcome to another Path of Exile video. The start of a new series, potentially. We'll see. We'll see how we go. Today, we're going to be exploring maps for the first time. I have no idea what I'm getting into. This is not the first character that you saw in the first series because that first character wasn't a seasonal character. And I want to get into Affliction sooner rather than later. So last week, we created a new seasonal character and I let my Discord choose my build and we went with Bone Shatter Juggernaut. And it's been so much much fun. And then we streamed for three streams in a row and it was so much fun to get this character through the campaign live with you guys. I discovered a love for streaming. Anyway, let's say hello to Frank. Come on, Frank. Boink. Hi guys. All right, let's get straight into it. Okay, so select one reward. Flooded map, glacier map, go bone crypt map. At this point, it, it's only about theming, right? What do I like in terms of theme? Let's go with bone crypt. Oh, by the way, I'm following the bone shatter juggernaut build from Max Roll. Maxroll.gg. Uh, they've got an amazing build over there. And I want to give props to the person who made that build called Tripolar Bear on YouTube. Go check him out. I think I have to put in the map device. I need to identify this potentially. Item quantity. So I'm going to guess that maps are levels and these levels have modifiers, right? And just something along like items, I guess they have rarities. So I put this in here. Now, what is all this? I'm not sure. Okay, let's just activate. Enter a map device portal. All right, let's get going. I hope my build works. I have all my auras. I've got all the rest going. So I'm going to be avoiding seasonal content until I do it for the first time in a video format. But today it's all about maps. So let's get going. As you can tell, nothing's really a problem for me at this point. I say that, I'm probably going to die. Oh my god, I just applied a new filter, and look at these, all six linked? I'll probably just grab what's important to me, probably, at this point. So what's my goal here? Find and defeat the map boss. What's this? I'm not sure what I just did. What just happened? Oh my god. Okay. Kraken loop breach ring. What what just happened? Was that part of the maps? Did I just discover a map thing? Okay, got a corrupted item out of it. Look how far we've come from our first episode of Path of Exile. Finding that beach. Well, dropping on that beach, I should say. I didn't find it. Yeah, pretty crazy. Okay, hi, Necromancer. Is that the one? Yes, it is. So I've completed the map and I've got some stuff down here that I need to check. Do I need any of this? Worm scale gauntlets. Okay, that's what I actually need and I don't see any there. What are these? Talk to Commander Kirak. All right, we'll go back home. Talk to Commander Kirak. Complete at least one non-unique yellow tier map to unlock these missions. Okay, so some missions are blocked and these missions, I can just take them and activate them, I guess. Explore the Atlas of Worlds. Let's do that. Unclaimed Kirak Vault Pass Reward. Oh, this is the famous um, battle pass you guys were talking about. Ooh, that's cool. Should I get it? Oh yeah, get a bunch of cosmetics for it. Oh, I should absolutely do it. 300 points, that's, oh my God, 30 bucks. 30 bucks for a battle pass seems a lot, but I'm happy to support the devs, so. Okay, we've got the points. I hope it's worth it. I really do. <laughs> Why can't I purchase the premium truck? That's weird. I did not expect that. Okay, well, I guess we'll see. I'll try and go talk to Tane. I spawned next to him earlier on. Who's this guy? I had no idea. That's not the guy. Oh, well. Maybe I shouldn't focus too much on it. I'll get back to that in a second. The Atlas passive skill tree. Yeah, I remember seeing this. This is probably the second time I'm seeing this, so I can't give you an authentic first view of this, but I am just awed by this tree. I haven't looked at the nodes. I don't know what they do, really. Um, I think something about specializing in other things strong boxes essences i think they change maps right so the good part is that i have asked my discord to help me on this one and see if there's a specific thing i'm supposed to do a specific direction i'm supposed to take turns out there is right here if i follow this path apparently i'll be able to get as many maps as i can while also avoiding any seasonal content for now so i'll just put my first point here two percent chance for one monster in each of your maps to drop an additional connected map I'm not really sure what that means but but sure, why not? Explore the Atlas of Worlds in search of power and information that might help the citizen vanguard defend Ray class against the coming darkness. So I finished the Bone Crypt, so now it's time for a new one. Oh, these are the missions again. Okay, map tier two. He only sells tier two. Will I survive a tier two one? Pure fields, field, I guess? Okay, so map device. Oh, I don't get a map for that. I just get, go to the fields, do the thing. All right. I love how they explode. Feels so good, feels so good. More. 
More. Yeah, you're not doing the damage you think you're doing, bud. Talk to you, Shadow Rattle, the Merciless. Ah, uh, this just feels good. Pig faced Bassinus. I think I need that for my build. Some people tell me like this is when the end game starts. You know what I mean? Anything before that, you've you've not even scratched the surface. So I wonder what that means. What am I going to be working towards here? That's the question. What's going to be the incentive to play? Is it this game that has like an extra blood pack or something that I can use that I can buy? I want to see blood everywhere. Oh, Arena. Oh, I remember this. This is in the campaign. Commander Kira, mission complete. Uh, okay. So the Discord has renamed uh, the Ballistas. So we don't have Ballistas with this guy anymore, but we have Totems. The Totem totem is called Bob. So whenever I put a Totem down, I got to say Boblista Boblista. <laughs> Okay, fields complete. I've completed the map. Let's identify these real quick. This is pretty good. Strength, dexterity, armor, evasion rating. I'm still terrible at like figuring out what I actually need. I know that I need my resistance though and I don't see any here. So there's some here, but I have a six link. So it's hard. I find it very difficult to figure out what item is better than another. You know what I mean? So I've completed that map, GG me, but I didn't pick up any new maps, unfortunately. So I'm going to continue 2% chance for one monster in each of your maps to drop an additional connected map. That's good. Sell some items. Actually, this I might be able to sell for some money. Stash, empty some stuff. I've been told to put what I don't want in here so that I can sell it for chaos orbs. Put some gems away for now. And then the rest of the currencies can just go do their own thing. So what now? I'm guessing I need to do more maps, but I don't have... Can he give me some maps? Yes, he sells maps. How about that? So map device... Oh, so Kirik missions are done. What's this? Oh, oh, these are the two maps I've done. Right. Is that how it works? You go like, boop, 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 boop. you do this, you do that. Okay. Oh, there you go. No, why can, can I not purchase the premium tab? Wait, I need to understand this. Oh, ooh, what's this? Where am I? Midnight packed mystery box. Okay, still can't do shit. Ooh, there you go. Got myself a breeding court and fields map. And I've claimed this, but I still can't purchase that. I mean, do I have enough coins or 315? That's weird. Hello. Why can't I purchase you? Okay, what if I, I'll exit and come back in. Let's go to Kirk's vault. Ah, there we go. It was bugged out. Bye. I've done it. I've spent money. All right, let's have a look. If I do this, oh, I get this, right? Midnight pack. Look at this. The game crashed. <laughs> What's that about? All right. Well, never mind. So if I remember correctly, I have to press N and I've got my box here. Yes, here we go. We're going to open it live. What do you think's in it? I got an environmental effects. Oh, that's lame. Oh, I got a boot skin somehow. I had no idea. Select microtransaction tier. There's tiers to microtransaction. What do they look like? Yeah, nice, I guess. Just really use some pants. And Frank could use a coat of some sorts. Wow, there's a bunch of vaults here. Do you unlock one at a time? This is unending. Oh my goodness. Well, that was not where I thought it was going. Well, I got a new map though, so I can go do that. Map device, as we've learned now. Fields, very good. What's this? Plus one increased quantity of items items or torment areas haunted by two additional tormented spirit your first time using this crafting option is free all right sure bring it on back to the fields whoa whoa, whoa. jump up jump up oh my goodness the game is struggling for some reason performance has taken a hit if you can believe it take all the currencies all the maps oh, i'm dropping maps now that's good did you see that? Did you see that lag? It's like it took a second to understand what I was trying to do and the effect it was going to have in front of me. What's this? Instilling orb. Adds an enchantment to utility flask. All right. Bob Lister, Bob Lister. Oh, I'm getting a bunch of more maps now. That's cool. By the way, my profile is now public on the POE website. Just type next villain. Nix villain. Nix. My name. Pseudonym. My avatar. The person who lives inside my head. Okay, let's go kill the boss now. Arena. So I've done all this already, right? This is similar. There he is. Drek. Apex Hunter. Now I'm collecting rage also as a new, new thing. I can spend a bit like um, my mana, except I've got none. But my rage, that's something cool. The only issue is I need mana to get my rage up, but we will fix that right now. I don't need any of these items. There you go. Did I finish that? I think I did. I did the boss, right? So can I upgrade these is my thinking here. No, I can't use this. What about upgrade a normal item to a rare item? Orb of Binding. Yeah, that worked. So now I have Grim Edge Strand Map. That's good, right? So now I can go do that. But first, the Mana Orb. Where is it? The Mana Mastery. I think that's important. Let's have a quick look at the build. No, let's look at something new. Introducing Path of Building. Yeah, there you go. 12% increased Mana Reservation, which now I know is all about the auras, right? So that's cool, I think. So let's put the map in there. Oh, I'm going to fields. God damn it. How many times has that happened to you when you just 
come out of a map and then, or come out of a something, go back into it by mistake. Okay, it's still here. We're good. What are these things? Area will contain incursions. Oh, but these, this is all the seasonal stuff. I don't need that. Torment. Let's go, baby. Oh, I like these. Latticed ring mail. Void axe. I'll take the sixth stuff and I'll sell it. Oh, I'm dead. How bad is it? Lost a bit of XP. I gotta be smarter. Okay, let's try that again. W-E-T for my auras. Oh, Citrin Amulet. I'm dropping so much stuff, it's actually a bit too much. Orb of Unmaking, that looks important. Arena. Okay, so does every map have an arena? Bob Lista, Bob Lista, come on. Getting some maps. Oh, there we go. Master of the Blade. Yeah, I'm out of mana too quickly. I need to figure something out there. Should I get another mana flask? Or God forbid, a mana aura? Superior worm scale gauntlets. Oh, that's what I need. Worm scale gauntlets. Okay, so I've, I'm done here. So now I'll go back, sell some stuff. That's how it goes, right? Oh, I got a point. Why did I get a point this time? If I'm to follow this build, I need to go here. Perfect. All right, so now what? Well, sell some stuff. Jesus Christ. How many PS5s did you spend <laughs> to buy that skin? Um, don't sell that. Sell the stuff you know you don't need. Keep the rest. Why don't we take some time and have a look at the maps tab that my Discord told me to get. So I have field maps, atlas bonus complete, which means I don't need to do this one again, but I haven't completed the other ones. Oh, look at that, seven? What does seven mean? What the hell is seven? Oh, you, you have seven of these. Oh, so I need to just do all the bonuses. Easy peasy. And I should improve them. What happens when I put two of the same in a thing? Interesting. Just go do it. I think that's where we're at. Doesn't work. Okay, well, I tried. Oh, I forgot to, that's what I was supposed to do. Get the mana thing. All right, let me just do a quick run home and get the mana gem. I need to buy a thing, go to my hideout. You want to see my luxurious hideout? Ta-da. Lily, that's who I'm supposed to talk to. So which one is the one that gives me mana? Uh, it's an aura. Okay, got a few here. Clarity, there you go. Put it in here. Bob's your uncle. All right, off I go back to the glacier and hopefully mana won't be that much of a problem anymore. Man, I'm dro dropping so many uniques. A spike shield. I'm sure someone will want that. I wonder if I can make a tab available for my Discord to just go and get whatever items they want from it. Should I level up clarity? Yeah, I'm sure I can. Mana is not a problem anymore, it seems. Everything dies when I touch it. Everything blows up and it feels real good. I'll wait until I a bit for a bit before I level up clarity again, just in case I don't need it. I want to see if I go out of mana again. Off to the glacier I go. I'm in the arena of the glacier. What are these green things that keep they keep disappearing? Superior corrupting cry support. Jeez, that's a mouthful. Hey Rectar, I'm here to wreck. Are. Atlas mission from NR reward. Oh, so now I've completed the glacier. GG me. Okay, so that map is done. So now I put in the next map and I'll put torment still. Oh, the tormented spirit. That's what I, that's, that's what it was. That's what I found, the tormented spirit, right? The green, the green thing, the green person. Everything is dying when I'm playing this character. <laughs> I need to have a kind of a cheat sheet around me or some sorts, you know, to remember all these uh, orbs and currencies. Atlas mission from Jun received. Wait, was that it? Did I did it do it? Oh, that was fast. Okay, so this is your sign to follow a guide if you're playing Path of Exile. Maybe not the first time. I, I don't take back any of my experience playing uh, Path of Exile in the campaign for the first time just by myself. Well, with you guys, but figuring out all the all the stuff little by little, it was worth it. But second time around, use a build guide. You'll have a lot more fun, which is a shame, isn't it? Right now, I'm just happy to smash stuff. It's a lot of fun. Veil scouting report. Reroll all of Kirik's Atlas missions, corrupting all non-unique maps. I need to start understanding what corruption means. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oof. I thought that was the end of me. I was trying to dash out of the way, but to no avail. Anyway, he's dead. Well, I've done it. So now back to Tortle, back to the Karu Shores. I think that stash tab is actually invaluable. The map stash tab, because it tells you which ones you've completed too, doesn't it? What is that? One, two, three. Oh, is it the level of the map tier? Right. Let's have a quick look at the Atlas screen. How am I doing? Am I doing okay? I'm not unlocking anything for these things. Oh, wait. Yes, I am. Drek Apex Hunter can be captured for Solar Relicish. Oh, is that the, the, the god thing? Right. So I'm kind of unlocking locking as I'm going along. All right, so do I need to do them all? Like there's some I haven't done, like the pier map. So why don't I do the pier map? I should probably level it up though. Wait, I'll just, I'll just do it real quick. You're dead. You're dead. You're all dead. Oh, there she is. Come here. 
So what happens when I kill her? Nothing. <laughs> Come back. Maybe I'm not being quick enough. I've heard her. She's around. There. No. Yes. Oh my god, I don't know why I'm running around. I should just leap slam all over the place like a normal barbarian. This has got to be it. The gauntlets. Ancient artifact. Bob Lista. Bob Lista. Dead. No. Disappearing. Where do you go? I don't remember ever doing this. Oh, ow. Bob Lista. Bob Lista. Let's go. There we go. Peer completed. I didn't get much for that, but it was not too bad. Okay. Done, I think. One more passive skill tree point to put in here. Following the left. I need to go towards precision, so I need to go over here. All right, back to my maps tab. On one, I've done them all. GG. So I don't need to mess with these anymore. I could even sell them potentially. And then, well, I don't seem to have any of these. Okay, maybe I'll just go and do a hard one, but I should probably improve it first. Look at this picked face bassiness. No, not what I need. Yeah, I need fire resistance and lightning resistance. That's what I actually need. Oh, this is pretty good. Plus 10 to all attributes. Plus 13 to all attributes. Fire resistance. Hmm. I need the lightning resistance though, don't I? Lightning resistance, what do I look like? Look like a fool. 82%. That's not too bad. Shall we try it? See what happens? Ooh, not great. But I get more attributes. I get more armor i get more armor i'll be fine i'll be fine i'll keep it in my back pocket just in case okay back to my stash let's have a look at these maps so i'm gonna do the highest map and see how difficult that is and i can improve it by using a orb of alchemy there we go players cannot inflict exposure monsters have 200 percent increased critical strike chance jesus christ okay they they're gonna crit me like there's no tomorrow and they're gonna do a lot of lightning damage and right now my lightning resistance is 65 percent which is 10 percent less than that i want it to be and we'll do torment because why not i still don't like understand the value of currency that much so i may be spending way too much money that i shouldn't on my or is a good all right wish me luck rage is building up so i use a uh, berserk to berserk got a map yep oh jump 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 i'm not going through all these items i don't see any that can be of real use anyway oh there we go tormented tormented person that's good for me i killed her and she gave me not much okay so what's the point of me paying money for them to be there i have no idea oh 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 see that damage Ooh la la meatballs arena let's go kill the tyrant where'd he go in his house you're dead as on my dagger whoa, whoa, whoa. why am i taking damage why am i taking damage chill out chill out chill out chill out it's all good it's all good i don't need any of these that's how you're supposed to play path of exile right you have a quick look there's nothing you need don't take it i got some ramparts map so i've got two different ones what do i do do i do them both because i want to improve my maps right and i don't think there's any improvement to be done if i play it the same one twice right what about my vault pass oh look at that look at that eight more and i'm done i mean not eight more i've done like it doesn't tell me probably two more and i'm, I'm done and i get my curse bringer boots that would have make me very happy oh i have never done rampart actually so i'll do the one with the best item quantity item rarity is better well 45 yeah i'll take that one yeah that's pretty good i'm not really scared actually i mean i've, I've survived really well and this is only level three map i can do that oh i unlocked something new oh so you can specialize them rogue exiles is like um, a seasonal thing right so i'll just go with torment but that's interesting wait there is something i need to figure out what happens if i put two of the same in the the map so i've got two ramparts can i combine them use them like in dragon ball z no oh, that's a shame what are these for then okay let's just go into another map complete them one by one and see what bonuses i can unlock i'm gonna clear this one so that i can make sure that i get more stuff more maps is what i really need six links are nothing should we just do this seasonal event just to spice things up just to spice things up a bit just do it a bit randomly he did say make sure about that placement which i definitely haven't done so okay detonate baby bubble bubblista bubblista come on show me what you got show me what you got game Come on. Just random rings. Make sure I pick up every piece of jewelry. Nothing I really want or need. I'm happy I did it. It's fun. Up the stairs we go. Or boot helmet. Oh, it's like a barbarian helmet. That could be fun. Yes, yeah, strong box. Bob Lister, Bob Lister. Whoa, 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 whoa. Some, a bow, a map. I should probably take the bow and sell it, right? That's what the filter does. Arena. So that must be the end of it then. I didn't drop any maps, did I? Oh my god. No maps at all. All right. Oh, some rogue markers. I gotta, I'm gonna have to try that out. Maybe next episode we'll do the rogues. They look fun. Oh, done. Two unclaimed Carrick Vault Pass reward. Let's go. Cool. Awesome. So I've unlocked some cool shenanigans. Yes. 
Love it. So like that. let me just double check what I just saw there. So this is the Kirek specialization. 60% increase at last scouting reports. Okay. So what if I went in any other direction? This is Beast Cherry. This is Betrayal. Oh, this is the Immortal Syndicate stuff. Delve. Strong boxes. So you could really customize like crazy. I love strong boxes. So potentially I could go like strong boxes in your maps have 50% chance to be guarded by an additional pack of monsters. And I can just do that. And then your maps contain an additional star strong box. That's incredible. Although you are repeating the maps a bit, if you know what you're getting, it's not fully random. So my little guide was given to me by a very good friend on Discord, our, our moderator, one of our two fantastic moderators. This was our good Discord moderator, Nimorgan and they gave me the idea to, to spec it this way so that I could just focus on maps for a bit and then potentially I'll respec later and I'll look at all these extra ones. Jesus, this, this is an, an unfinishable. What is that? Look at that animation. Oh, it's on both sides. This is insane. What about my actual like passive skill tree? Can I see all stats there? No, I guess that's C, isn't it? Yeah, it kind of is. All right, I'm level 72 and I've unlocked some Kira Vault stuff. So I want to go check that out. Come on, Frank. Let's go get ourselves some new boots. Oh, is it the next one? Oh, that's so cool. They went above and beyond, didn't they? That's awesome. So I get three orbs of unmaking, which grants at last passive skill refund points, which I'm going to need. Curse Bringer boots. Hey, I already have boots though, but you know what? I'm going to put them on and they just, oh, are you serious? Boots which leave a trail of insects in your wake. Oh my God. That is so cool. That is so cool. All right. I'm excited again. Let's continue with some maps. So I always put the maps back in because that way I can use this to help me figure out what I've done and what I haven't done. Well, I've done all these Atlas bonuses already. So what's the point? Oh, I've not done laboratory. Off we go. Oh, lever. Can't do it. Oh, I need to be careful. Oh, there we go. Strong box. Let's go. Bob blister, Bob blister. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Two stone ring. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Nearly the six links. I'll take it. Oh, chateau. I've never done the chateau. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, the explorer. I know I'm not supposed to do seasonal content, but I am tempted because I really like her thing. Ah, go on then. I'll just, I'll do it. I'll do one. I'll do one. I really shouldn't because now I get the freaking quest like an idiot. Hello. I just wonder how well I, I can do on this, you know? I still don't understand how it works. The shrine of empowerment. Oh God, six seconds. Run, go faster. Go faster. Three seconds. Ah, one second. Three seconds. Yes. Next. One second. Oh no. So close. That was fun. I'm not taking your silly quest. We're going to do a specific video for this. Yeah. So I've done one, two, one more. One more southwest to do. Ramparts map. Yep. I'll take that. Come back here. Eh. Hey. Done. So now I can turn the lever. Ooh, what the hell? Boblista, Boblista. Come on, Boblistas. Get to work. There we go. More. And then I go into the arena. Uh, it's a really fun map. Rift Walker. Where is she gone? Through the rift. Whoa, 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 whoa. Get out of there. Get out of there. Oh my gosh. Oof. Okay. You got to be careful, huh? It's not a given. It's not a given. She's dead. There we go. And no, nothing crazy, unfortunately. I did uh, get an at last passive point though, which I'll continue putting here. And one of these, very close to the precise technique now. It's not like I need it, but all right. Ultimate power. Oh, this is a pretty good ring. Look at that. Plus 13 to fire and lightning resistance. Plus 31% to fire resistance. Plus 36 to lightning resistance. That ruby ring can die. How, what was my resistance like a second ago? 61, 76, 65. There you go, I'm capped. How about that? You guys proud of me yet? Look at everything we've done together. The map's in, you know the drill by now. Though I've not done the Chateau map, but I wanna improve it though, right? That's something I definitely need to do. I don't know what to do with these extra maps. Figure something out. I, I wanna have a quick look real quick at my uh, Atlas screen. So the ones I unlock are the ones, oh, how do I get to this? Waka Wairu Tuha. Mm. Oh, these are like really good. So where is Chateau? There it is. Oh, interesting. There's 115 of these. Wow. And these are things that I need to unlock by completing Maven's Invitation. That's the first one. So much to look into. So much. Oh, what's this? What is that? Okay, let me pick it up and I'll have a look at it in a second. Veil Pyramid map. Okay. Isn't Veil like a, some kind of corrupting thing? Oh, Veil. Maps, maps, maps everywhere. Great. Oh, Artisan Strongbox. Let's go. Boblista, Boblista. <laughs> oh my god. Prisms improves the quality of a gem, improves the quality of a flask, improves the quality of a map. Lovely. I really need to use a bit of my rage. <laughs> it just, it's so much better when I use the rage. Whew. 
Oh my god. Why did I get a million silken hoods? Does anybody need one? I have about 30. Could become a reseller of silken hoods. That is so weird. Is that a bug? I mean, that must be one in a million. Oh, look at this guy. I've never seen him before. And you're dead. Iron Gauntlets, Veil Pyramid map. Yeah, I would kill myself if I... Not kill myself, sorry. I would hate myself if I missed one of these maps and I just left it behind or something. One at last skill point. Yeah, boy. So what is this scarab? Your ancestry has been much maligned. Area contains two additional Harbingers. Can be used in a personal map device to add modifiers. Oh, no. I don't uh, okay, let's try that. And there's modifiers for the maps that you can add to the modified maps. Just brain's about to explode. Oh, is that why I was told to buy a fragments? Breach, general, breach, scarab, eldritch, eldritch, fragments, maven fragments. Just never ends. Gems, currency, orb of alchemy, dunes. Well, we're good. We're off to the dunes. And we're going to add increased monster variety. Player cannot inflict exposure. That can be good. I feel like exposure is one of my main things. Fine, we'll check it out. And I've added this. Area contains two additional Harbingers. What's a Harbinger? If I can't do exposure, is that really gonna just ruin my build? Well, these guys are still exploding, so maybe not. Okay, my rage is nearly at max. Oh, okay, here we go. Rage. Rage. What is this guy? Look at his name. His I can't look. What's wrong with his name? Bob Lister, Bob Lister. How is he? What is this guy? He disappeared. A chisel, a map for the fields. Again, I don't know what to do with that. Can I sell it? Can I give it to people on my Discord? You'll be happy to know that the Discord channel is called the Nyx Court. The blacksmith, he looks like the guy from Act 1. You're dead. Soon. Nice. The dunes are complete. So now that that's done, we go back. I have a not less point to put in. There we go. Now I have... Maps can be duplicated, but what's the point of duplicated maps? I wonder. Unless it's like the potions. You can get better potions, right? If I go to maps, there you go. Four maps of the same. One, two, three. What happens if I try to sell that? Is it like the potions? One, two, three. Kinda? It went from tier two to tier three. Guess that's good. I haven't unlocked any scarabs though, unfortunately. So we'll have to find some more. The Veil Pyramid. Here we go. Honestly, I'm doing pretty good. It's fun how different the game can feel once you've got a build. It's night and day, like the, the struggle that was the first campaign for me in a fun way. Don't fear. It's a fun, it's still fun. But when I use the build, it's like, oh, I'm actually really, really powerful. The difficulty comes when you have to identify items that are good for you, good for your build anyway, because that's the hard part for me. I find it there's so many affixes and not to mention crafting. We'll have to check out crafting in a video potentially. See how far we can take the crafting. Is this door? Is this? Oh, stairs. Okay, multiple levels. Gotcha. I thought it was a bit short. Boom. Oh god, it feels so good. You know what it feels like? Bone Shatter Juggernaut is the equivalent of playing around with- Wait, don't let me die. It's the equivalent of playing around with, um, bubble wrap. Like, when you hit an enemy and they all blow up, it feels like you're just blowing up a full sheet of bubble wrap. And that, my friends, it's a special feeling. Arena. There we go. Easy peasy. Kill the hollow lady. Bublista, bublista. Wait, uh, uh, come back here. Uh, uh. Dead. Nice. Look at all the stuff I got. Take all the rings, always. That's what I've been told. New point in the passive skill tree. Notable at last passive skills grant nothing, but my small ones are increased by 100%, which means I'm going to be dropping maps left, right, and center. Not sure why, but here we go. You know, when we were leveling this this character up, I streamed for the first time in my life, basically. And I've kind of realized that I really, really, really enjoy it. So if you guys think it'd be worth it, maybe we should do more streams. Maybe if I find the time somewhere, we should do more streams. Let me know what you think. Can I craft mats? Should I go to the crafting bench real quick and have a look if I can craft maps? Probably, right? Although crafting is not really crafting new things, is it? It's crafting affixes and stuff like that. No, you can't. All right, well, let's go back to the epilogue and see if I can do anything else that revolves around maps. It doesn't seem like it. So maybe I should just do the highest map I have and then, which is the Veil Pyramid map, which I need to increase. There we go. And just do that in, on repeat, basically. Is that the idea? Until I get more? That makes sense? I think I'll do the 2% increased quantity of items. There we go. So I'm going to do this, but I'm not going to unlock anything. This is purely to get more maps, right? That's my understanding. Dead. Everything. Everybody is dead. Sense of power is making me feel good. All right, this gets to, this game is easy, guys. I don't know what you guys are talking about. This game is easy peasy. <laughs> okay, I got a bunch of maps out of that. That's cool. Okay, so there's one thing I'm wondering about. How does trade work? Maybe I should ask my Discord for that. Or maybe you guys can help me understand it. Because I have a bit of currency, so it might be a good idea, you know? Anyway, so I now have a map here, level 5. I've never done a level 5 map, siege map. Quick upgrade. There we go. This is the highest map I'm about to do. 
Activate. Here we go. Beetlejuice. 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 Oh my god. I really blow them up. Okay, wait just a second. What the hell is going on? Why is it 14th of July here? Or 4th of July for you Americans? Oh, rusted sulfide scarab. Cool, a scarab. Nice. Oh, I'm out of mana. That's not good. And I can't upgrade clarity anymore. Why am I out of mana? Obviously, the answer is like because I using all the mana, but I shouldn't be out of mana so quick. I have like leech and stuff like that, right? Do I not? Come on, drop some maps. Yeah, laboratory. Thank you. Arena time. Oh my goodness. Oh wow. Die, 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 die. He's not dying. I need to do this. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Run around a bit. Run around a bit. Run around a bit. I've got no rage. And he's dead. Woo. Crystal ore map, bog map, moonstone ring. I don't need any of these. Back to town we go. And I got some map tier seven. Are you serious? We're just jumping like that to seven? Holy guacamole. So I need to go to seven. We'll do the seven one because we're crazy like that. Although if I remember correctly, there was something about them having to be a certain color of rarity, right? Can't remember them now, but I hope it was right. So what about this passive skill point? Where should we put that? We'll put it wherever path of builder tells us to put it. And that will be be. We're gonna have to do a lot of back and forth <laughs> here for the elemental resistance, fire resistance, and prismatic skin. Or we could go for butchery. You know I prefer butchery. So let's go for that. Attacks with melee weapons deal 12% increased damage with ailments. And I put a bunch of ailments on people. I'm the ailment king. That's my official name. All right, map device. Put the map that I picked up a second ago. I definitely did, but I didn't. Bog map. Nothing like a swamp to get you in the mood. All right, into the bog we go. What are the modifiers? Lightning damage, great. Chaos Orb, yes, money. Wow, these are cool. Worm scale gondolets, that's what I need. Cool. The good part about this is that it's always fun. You always feel like you're progressing towards something in a way, especially with the battle pass. I'm progressing to become the full beetle man. Everybody's dream. The arena is there, but I'm, I'm, I need more maps. Give me all your maps, please. Let's go to the arena. It's unfortunate I didn't get many maps, but it is what it is. Bob Lista, Bob Lista. Do your work, Bob Listas. Oh, what's this? Skullbeak, what the hell? It's got voice acting and everything? How can I get to it? Skullbeak. Face tank, done. The Maven's Beacon allows you to call the Maven to a map from your map device. What's that? Upgrade the map device. You have caught the interest of the Maven and she has given you a beacon to summon her to witness your battles. Bring it to the map device to upgrade it. That's unreal. Okay, oh, and there's a nest here. Okay, back to town. What's going on? That was super exciting. Okay, so I've done one of the hardest maps for me right now, the seven, right? I've done the seven and I was witnessed by the Maven, whatever the hell that means. So now I'll go to map six. I'll have to improve it, of course. I'm gonna run out of these at some point. The orbs of alchemy. So use that to improve it. Monster speed is bigger, right? Okay, okay. But I do have the Maven's beacon, which I am very excited to use. So I'll just put the um, thicket map inside, which I've never done before. Fortune favors the brave, can be applied to maps. One of the options available from this device will be applied at random, including options you have not yet unlocked. Oh, that's interesting, that's cool. I might do that later on, because right now I want to do Maven. Wait a second, Maven progress. Maven's invitation, the twisted, the form, the forgotten, the hidden, the feared. What is going on? The Elder Slayer. Defeat tier six map bosses while the Maven is present in order to receive her invitation. Wow. Okay, let's work towards that. The Envoy. Who are you? You have called the Maven to this place, for I too heard it. She is near and eager to witness your struggle. Do not disappoint her. Okay, yeah, no pressure. Jesus. Oh, what's this? I still don't know what that is, but it is the coolest effect ever. What does it mean? Do I need to kill all the purple people? The clasp hand of someone... Oh, and it's gone. But I got a raptured world breach ring. Don't know what that means. Gardens map. Yes, I need more maps. Feed me maps. Crafting recipe. New recipe unlocked. Cool. Let's get into the arena. No, no, actually, I want to get more maps. So I'm going to do a bit more of this for a bit. Because that's what the POE developers want me to do. They want me to clear all these guys. Surely they didn't put all this time into summoning these guys for me to just ignore them. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> Oh, so she's here, the Maven. There she is up there. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, champion kite shield. Oh, I got a passive skill point. Sure. Increase the quantity of items found in maps. Yep. Let's have a look at the map device for a second. Right, so I'm two out of three. Okay. Can I use it again? I haven't... Yes, I, I should be able to. I'm answering my own questions as I'm talking. Oh, why did I walk so fast? That was weird. Oh, I've got one more. The damned roost. 
Nice. So let's go do that. Is there anything else that I wanted to do? I don't think so. Call the Maven to tier six maps. Okay, you defeated two out of three. I'm excited. Map device? Yes. I will do Fortune Favors the Brave because I'm insane. And let's jump right into it. Ooh, you should not refuse the, the call of the Maven. What even is a Maven? Like a bird? What am I supposed to do with all these unique, unique items that I'm getting left, right, and center? I'm going to open a unique shop. Strand map. Nice. Orb of Horizon? Sure. Well, I'm dead. I wasn't paying attention. What happened? Well, I was paying attention. It just wasn't very good. Oh, I can't do that too many times. Face smash. Face smash. Oh my god, these guys are throwing themselves at me. Of course, you use Berserk when you have no rage left. Oh my god. A chisel, cartographer's chisel, sure. I need to go and discover the rest. Get as many maps as I can. All right, into the arena we go for the last challenge of Maven. Enough to get her attention anyway, that's the idea. There she is. There's the other one anyway. Whoa, whoa, no, 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 no. That's not how you do it. Just do the whole thing again. Okay, all right, all right, focus. Okay, here we go. Get some buffs on, get your socks on. Okay, I'm sorry, but you are really damaging me. Boblista, Boblista. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm out of mana, of course. I'm dead. Oh, this is difficult, guys. I have met my match. Okay, so I have a silver mask of the hedgehog that gives me onslaught, and that's a bit dangerous, isn't it? Plus, my blood rage makes me take more damage, I think. Yeah, yeah. So maybe don't use blood rage. Berserker, though, that's a good one. I have three more tries. Pop Quicksilver. Boblista, Boblista, stay there. Stay there. Heal. Jump, jump away. Boblista got one. Good. Continue. That aura is dangerous. Jump away. Boblista, Boblista, jump away. Be careful, be careful. Oh. <laughs> I need to let Bob Lista do mo most of the work, I think, on that one. And just, like, make sure I'm not in any of these auras. Okay, Bob Lista, Bob Lista. Walk away, walk away. I can't walk away. Pop some stuff. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Yes! Teamwork. Whoa. Highland Blade. Looks good. Maven's Invitation. The Atlas. Siege map. Yeah, I don't need any of this extra stuff. So what is the Maven's Invitation? There it is. Maven's Invitation. The Atlas. For those who must not endure it, there may be found a perverse joy in watching the struggle for survival. Okay. Okay, well done. GG. We only had one go left. That was dangerous, to say the least. Okay, so what does that look like now? Because I haven't really leveled anything up in between, so... Defeat 2-6. The Mayville will witness and affect this map's boss encounter. So I've done three out of three, so... Oh, there it is. The Maven has invite you to attempt a greater challenge. Use the invitation in your map device to attempt it. Ooh, this is spooky. Okay, here we go. Enter the Maven Crucible. Whoa. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Oh, interact to begin the challenge. <laughs> I'm so scared. Is that you, Maven? Messengers of the Hollow. Okay. Am I supposed to move? Because this guy's not moving, so. Okay, let's get out of that big zone. Boblista, Boblista. Get out, get out. What's with my... My attack speed doesn't seem to be very quick. Boblista, Boblista. Let's get that skull beak. Oh, I'm fighting everybody at the same time. Okay. Come here, skull beak. No, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm not dying. I'm not dying. Boblista, Boblista. Come on, don't let me die. No. Is that it? No, I probably have as many times as I had before, right? Okay, Maven Crucible. I'm gonna need some better gear after this at some point. I'm gonna have to figure that one out. Maybe I can find stuff in trade, right? If I can figure out how trade works. Okay, kill this guy. Kill Skullbeak. Come on, Skullbeak, die. Boblista, Boblista, get out of it. Get out of this thing. All right, go, 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 go. Dead. Oh, I did this. I did it, GG. Some stuff that I don't need. Maven's gift. Interact to allocate Atlas passive points. Oh, I get one? Okay, not much of a gift. What now? Call the Maven to tier eight plus. Right, that was fun. That last part was super exciting. I obviously need better gear soon-ish, um, but if we had a quick look at my Atlas screen, I'm doing pretty good. 16 out of 115, I mean, <laughs> it's not too bad, I guess. So I've done all these. I have not done all these, but I'm missing some like maps. I have not done all all these and I have one here not done all these not done all these so it seems to be sort of become really difficult for me around six seven but I guess that's not too bad it's you know it could be worse I really need um defiance I think it is as an aura I just don't have anything right now to use it with yeah there we go I think that brings us to the pros and cons let me have a think about it two very boring minutes later 
played for a few hours now and I think I get the gist of it. I'm still struggling with understanding what items are better for my build, but I am using this build from maxroll.gg um, to figure it out. In any case, let's do some pros and cons. So let's start with the cons. I think uh, the onboarding was a bit messy, potentially. I mean, I know you guys tell me read everything you see, right? And I did try to read everything I saw, um, but like the onboarding for the Atlas was a bit all over the place. And I think it's because there's so much to show you, you know, but in a way you can only do what you think is right at that moment. I think the best way to understand this is probably to find a guide online, potentially. I'm sure there are guides for this Atlas online. So yeah, I think that's like the best way to get into it. I don't know if I would want to go in blind on this one, I have to say. I don't know if it's like the, um, the joy of crafting a build for the first time. I don't think it's the same here. I think it's different. I think a guide for the Atlas might be a good idea. A good shout. Maybe I should watch a video of it or something and get a better idea. Is there any other cons I can think of? I don't know how accessible it is to know what map you have to do and not do. Uh, I found that a bit complicated. I'm so glad I got that stash tab. Um, so I'm not saying it's pay to win, but I'm saying it's pay for convenience in this one. Uh, if you get the stash tab, which is less than 10 bucks, so I guess it's okay. You can actually like put all your maps and it shows you the ones you completed, the ones you haven't. And that's really, 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 really a quality of life improvement on maps for sure. And then if you, I don't, I don't think I have any other cons to be fair. Like it's still a lot of fun. Uh, so let's talk about the bros of the maps. Another passive tree I think is a huge bro. It could be a con for some people, especially if you're still not over how big the first one is. Um, but a passive tree around Atlas is in one word, genius. To be able to customize the way you form these rifts or these maps as we call them. Absolute genius. I love that. Um, it's exceptional, honestly. If I had to think of another pro, um, map modifiers, but that's also part of like the pro we had before. So if I had to think of another pro, masterly crafted. That's the pro. This maps feature feels masterly crafted. And it's probably the result of 10 years of work, of course, and, and back and forth and, and stuff like that. But I'm looking forward to doing more of them because there's always something to look forward to. There's always something to work towards is what I'm trying to say. So yeah, well done, GGG, for, for making such an impressive system. I'm really curious to the rest of this screen, like the Atlas screen. What else am I going to discover? What was the Maven thing I just went through? Oh my God, I'm so close to this. See something to work towards. Um, And what what the hell? You know, this passive skill point tree is insane, especially as I level up. Like I'm going to do this for a bit and then I'm probably going to respec all this to focus more on, on one of these seasonal pieces of content. But holy guacamole, there's so much to do. And they've thought about everything. H having a search here is also fantastic. So yeah, I mean, wow. Um, I really can't wait. The Maven thing? What's that about? I, am I going to have more? Did I unlock any of the things they showed there? So on the Maven stuff, Maven's invitation deformed. It seems like there's stuff that I still haven't done here that aren't. Did I, was there any, can I recognize any of these names? I don't think so. But if these are all different every time, blah, that's incredible. Honestly, absolutely incredible. So yeah, anyway, this, got, this video has gone on for too, too long. So listen, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Let me know what you want to see in the next video. Uh, do you want me to continue? new maps? Do you want me to go into season work? To like having a look at how the other seasons are functioning? You are going to shape the future of this uh, Path of Exile journey for me. So yeah, thank you so much. If you want me to do streams, let me know. Uh, there's a lot of things that you don't want to miss out during these streams that are happening. Uh, if you want to support me, you can join the YouTube membership program, which is a fantastic way to help. Or you can just join me on Discord. Come on Discord, have a chat. We've got some moderators now. They're fantastic. We're creating an amazing safe space for people to come and uh, talk positively about uh, ARPGs and, and share what they love about these games. Again, thank you so much and we'll see you in the next video. Say bye, Frank. We'll see you soon. Bye.